I just wanted to jump on here really quickly and explain a couple of things. Um, the grocery haul you're about to see is not a representation of what I buy on a weekly or like even monthly basis. Um, if you're not familiar with my channel, this is um, just to replenish some of the things that I depleted on my um, medical leave. Uh, recently, I haven't I haven't went food shopping for two months, like a little a little under two months. Um, and this is just to like replenish things in my apartment. Um, so uh, I just started working back again, and you guys know that I like to um like make my food for like lunch and like breakfast i just prefer to cook and bring to my job so i really do need all the food that you're about to see and none of it's going to go to waste i hate wasting food so i'm going to utilize everything um and the reason why i didn't like order any like um groceries or anything like that is because um my job made it a little bit difficult to um get like leave uh like paid leave um it, everything went through now and i still haven't received a check yet but i'm thinking i'm going to get them in the mail or something um but everything went through and i got a confirmation that i am going to start receiving money so it just like alleviated some of the <laughs> some of the pent-up stress that i had um and i just felt more comfortable ordering food now but i do still have like food i'm not like starving or anything like that like i don't know <laughs> like this is my pantry like i still have like i still have food i just um I just need to I just need to like replenish some things this is gonna be the first batch it was gonna be many deliveries <laughs> of food um, I'm going to show you guys um, this is the first thing that came today um, everything is from Walmart excluding these two books um, I ordered from Walmart Aldi's and Amazon basically what I was doing was figuring out what I needed to replenish my stock in my house and then which site had the cheapest one because originally I was going to order from all three anyway so I might as well save some coin and I was under budget you guys so I was able to get some things that I not I didn't need but I wanted um and still became I was still under budget so I'm really excited about it so let's jump into these books that I got from Amazon um so when I was off work and I was healing from my big surgery um this guy's <laughs> reels and videos kept popping up and you know eventually I was skipping in because like I don't want to hear any of <laughs> this guy talk or whatever but um one of them played and then I was listening and I was like okay and I watched another one and then um two weeks later <laughs> I ordered his books from Amazon it was $15 for the both of them and I haven't done any research on this person individually. I haven't done anything. I haven't Googled him. I literally just typed in 12 rules of life. La, 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 la. <laughs> it's been so long since I did like, you know, this. So I'm kind of like rusty. But what I did was um, type in 12 rules of life. And it was like a bundle deal. So I just got it. Um, yeah, I don't know if I'm going to read them now. But this is definitely going on my bookshelf as a must read in the future. Um... Okay, so this is Amazon, this is um, Walmart. So my friend, I needed to pick up some hair gel and she recommended these two. Um, we have like similar hair textures, so I feel like it will work for me. Mine just is like slightly more coarser than hers, but still, she swears by these, so I got them. Hopefully it works. This is a hold hair gel and this is a hold humidity control hairspray um yeah so i picked those two up and this was under five dollars for the both of them so i'm hoping that like <laughs> i didn't just waste my money even though it was only five dollars is whatever but i'm hoping it works you know um and i gained so much weight so you're gonna see a lot of more diety things um than normal because <sighs> yeah your girl gained 20 pounds while i was healing so i need to like i need to get it together and you guys know i love jello so i got the sugar-free jello this is two raspberry ones and i thought it was a strawberry because i love the strawberry 
um, but it turns out I bought the raspberry. So I got two of these and I got some already made sugar-free jello. This is the orange and the strawberry. So, yep, got those two. And I actually ordered, this is so silly to me, but I ordered two of these 12 pack veggie straws and they only sent one today and the next one is coming in like four days from now. So I'm just like, okay, all right, <laughs> like this is weird, but okay. Um, so I got four, um, so it's four of the sea salt, four of the ranch and four of the cheddar cheese. And I picked up this dress, it was $5. So I was like, oh, let me let me um get it i'm super excited about it okay i got it in a large and i'm really excited to wear it and try it on um it just looks so like simple but like elegant you know and it was five dollars so why not and i had some extra coin so <laughs> why not um yeah i got it in a large so yeah so first haul down okay second delivery um, so everything is from Walmart, excluding this book here, and it's Choose Your Perspective. Um, I kind of want to read this now, but I am reading a book now. Sorry, I don't know if I'm in frame. <laughs> I am reading a book, so I'm going to keep this to the side. The rest of this stuff is from Walmart. Starting off, I got the 18-count applesauce. Um, and this is the regular applesauce. I actually like the peach applesauce better, but they didn't have the 18-count for it. And it would have been more expensive if I would have... It has been more expensive. So I got the applesauce. And then I got um, mixed fruit. Um, this is the one with the no sugar added. This... I usually like the cherry mixed fruit best. But they didn't have them separately. So I decided to get the 12 count of the mixed variety. Um, yeah, and I, I'll eat all of this. The only one that I don't really like is the orange one. Um yeah it's the orange one so um it's peach mixed fruit with cherry and this mixed fruit got that then i got um this snack pack and it's sugar-free as well it's six chocolate six vanilla um then i got some popping corn because i was out um for my air popper it was the cheapest one it's a two pound and i think it was like a dollar twenty something i don't know um around there anyway so i got that I got some sugar-free um, like caramels. This is the mixed one. This is the caramel coffee, the caramel chocolate, and the regular caramel. And it's the sugar-free candies. Um, I don't really like coffee-flavored candy, so I'm not sure if I'll like that. But whenever I have like a sweet tooth, I want to be able to have like options, you know? So um, I picked up some of those. And then I also picked up these sugar... Sorry. <laughs> those are your sugar. I picked up these sugar-free jolly ranchers and um i've never tried any of these sugar-free candies so i know i have to watch out because they have something in it that's kind of like a laxative but if i have like one at a time i think it'll be fine so i got those and i picked up this tuna helper it's tuna creamy broccoli um because like i don't really like like tuna salad but lately, I've been like, maybe I want some tuna salad. Like, I've been wanting tuna salad. And I'm not, like, a salad person. Like, like I'll have potato salad, but macaroni salad, seafood salad. I'm not really, like, a big fan of it. Um, but anyway, so I got this because I have never, I don't think I've ever made tuna salad, like, myself. Only <laughs> ate what other people made. So I was like, oh, let me pick this up. Maybe it's to help my craving. Um... Then I picked up some Smart Pop Kettle. Um, this is from when I'm at work and I want like a, like a snack or whatever. Um, it's easier for me to do this as opposed to um, some other snacks that I, that I have. <laughs> I picked up some sugar-free shortbread. Um, I've never had this before, so I don't know. I was trying to be like healthy. I know all the sugar-free because they put like Splenda and all that stuff is not good for you, but I'm trying. <laughs> I got this Skinny Pop popcorn and it's the white cheddar only because I wanted some of that white cheddar popcorn. The one that's in a black bag. I don't know if you guys are familiar with it, but I wanted that. Um, and I was like, oh, let me just try to be a little bit healthier. So I got um, this and... <clears throat> 
I don't think I snack on popcorn more than I snack on like, I don't know, Takis, but I just realized I picked up three popcorn. Okay. Um, and then I picked up these 25 bag of Takis because you guys know I love these Takis. Um, and then I picked up King Arthur. This is my um, favorite um, like flower, um, the King Arthur. And I got the Unbleached All Purpose. This is the five pound. I just need to pick up some more flour for like bread and stuff. Um, and then here's the naughty. Okay, I picked up these um, caramelitos. Caramelos. I keep saying caramelitos. Whatever. So this is the Cadbury caramel bars. Um, I picked up three of them with the king size, and I picked up some Twizzlers, also the king size. And when I say king size, I thought it was like the big pack because it was like two dollars. It was like a dollar or something. So I'm thinking like, I don't know. I should have just paid attention to like the ounces. And this actually is from Amazon as well. I picked up some nail, press on nails. Hopefully these work. And I don't know if I told you guys this already, but I picked up some paper towels. This is the Scott and this is the six count one because I need to pick up some more. And that is the second delivery. Sorry for the lighting, um, my plant grow light is on, but um, this is from Walmart, it just came. I got um, two eight packs of Slim Fast Shakes and one of the powder Slim Fast Shakes. Um, so I got vanilla and strawberry, and yeah, I got these from Walmart. You guys, so my Aldi delivery, that wasn't supposed to come for another 30 minutes. <laughs> got delivered okay so i'm gonna run through this pretty quickly because this video is super long my stove is dirty because i was throwing all the stuff on top of it so it's a little dusty and have like onion flakes on it um so i picked up a 10 pound bag of russet potatoes um 10 pounds is a lot but i do need to re dehydrate some um potatoes because i don't have any more dehydrated potatoes and um yeah and then also i've been on like a potato kick lately like potato soup like you guys don't even <laughs> you don't even know so i need to pick up some more potatoes i picked up two um loaves of bread obviously one's going to be on the freezer and then one i'm gonna use now um so i picked up two loaves i picked up some more of these um stuff baby bella mushrooms <laughs> Oh my goodness, they're so good. I really enjoyed them. So um, this is definitely going to be in the freezer again. It was really nice. I really liked it. Picked up some Mexican style um, blend um, cheese for like if I want to make tacos. I got this three or oh, three. <laughs> yeah, I got this three um, head of romaine lettuce for like salad preps, meal preps when I go to work and stuff. And for sandwiches, for tacos, for whatever. So I got that. Frozen vegetables. I got broccoli florets and I got Brussels sprouts. I also wanted to get string beans, like the thin ones, but they didn't have any. So just give me a refund on that. You guys know I have to get grapes. So I got some red grapes and I got some green grapes. Yeah. I wanted to try these like egg um like egg wraps so i pick up some and also i picked up some cheddar cheese wraps and i'm not sure about this brand this is i guess like an aldi's brand i think um anyway uh i used those um wraps that amazon sent me by accident and i turned them into um like chips and then also i use them as wraps um and i really like them I really like them so I got some more um and I was like oh let's try this so I got that got some zucchini but um yeah no that's actually fine I picked up some zucchinis the three count one I picked up some navel oranges it's a bag what are these called grape tomatoes got some grape tomatoes baby cucumbers mini cucumbers oh my goodness i love these these are so cute and adorable and they're just like so easy to snack on got some hot dogs this is the chicken and pork one and i actually like these better like i like i enjoy those jumbo really like fake hot dogs so i picked up some of those i got some butter usually i get 
my eggs from Amazon, but Amazon didn't have the eggs that I like in stock when I went to go order. So I just picked this up from Aldi's. This is the brown eggs. I got two of them by accident. But now that I think about it, I'm happy I got two because um okay yeah i'm happy i got two because i usually get the 18 count anyway and um yeah so yeah i'm pretty pretty excited about that i want to try this it's a mediterranean oh it feels weird it's a mediterranean um like salmon it's like herb salmon so i picked this up and i think i'm going to put this in our refrigerator um uh, and eat it pretty soon i think um yeah, or I'm gonna put it in the freezer. Actually, I put everything in the freezer. I don't know when I'm ever get to this, and it's like too close to the Best Buy date for me to just keep it in the refrigerator. But yeah, it's a it's a pretty good pretty good piece. I want to say um, it was twelve fifty nine, but on um, oh it's nine ninety nine. So on the website it was like nine ninety nine. So I thought it was the price, but it's per pound. That makes sense. So I got that. And I picked up some chicken, um, chicken breasts. Obviously, I'm have to clean this and separate them and all that stuff. Um, yeah, so I picked up some chicken breasts as well. And that is what I got from Aldi's, you guys. I still have a bunch of frozen vegetables. Actually, I got I got two more bags of frozen broccoli, and I got like a mixed vegetable, and I still have some of those thin string beans left in it, like half a bag. So I'm pretty set on like veggie wise as of right now so yeah um yeah yeah this is my this is my haul you guys oh gosh was it in focus you guys will see me when i upload another video um at 2 p.m <laughs> i don't know when what day is gonna be um yeah enjoy the rest of your day Okay, so I got the this by accident. It was like a really good deal on it. And I got the Scott paper towels already, but I forgot to take this out of my cart. I got this from Walmart as well. And it's a six roll of the Viva um, cloth napkins. And I love, this is my favorite brand, but it's always like, expensive and i can't like justify buying it so i picked up some of those and i picked up some toilet roll or some toilet tissue this is scott one and it's a 20 uh yeah it's a 20 uh 20 pack one so i got some scott toilet tissue and some more paper towels chicken is clean and prepped and divided into five different servings um so this can either be two meals or two lunches depending on what i make um this can um i already like seasoned it with salt and pepper um i just thought it'd be easy to lightly season with salt and pepper although i forgot i got the coarse sea salt and I opened the wrong side and this a lot a lot more than I wanted to put in fell in um so I have these here and then I also have some chicken breast cooking one because I want to taste how salty it is and two it's always good to have some chicken breast that's like grilled already ready to go just in case I want to have a salad tonight or something um yeah this can't go wrong with just having um some in the refrigerator and when i grill the chicken um it lasts for three days in the refrigerator so i have three days so well two days i don't trust it after two days but really three days um but i have it frying here i think it's almost time to flip it over um yeah so i'm gonna put it inside this bag and put it inside the freezer and here's my here's where i um separate my chicken